Hi guys, it's Lynn with Soft Squares. I'm gonna do something different today. We are going to open the mystery boxes. Stick around and see what that is and what's inside it. This is the opening of the mystery box that I am putting out. These are shipping no later than July 10th and there's still some available, but I wanted to give you guys a sneak peek on what's in it and exactly what it is. The mystery is you don't know what the quilt will look like until you're done with it or near the end, but um, typically when you have a mystery quilt, the shop or the website that you're using will send you your clues once a month or once every couple of weeks. Well, I'm giving you all the clues for the whole quilt all at once. They're all individually sealed envelopes and I'll show you all of that and you work at your own pace. There are going to be video tutorials that will be put up by Leanna Nieves from Pastry Queen's Farm Adventures. If you don't follow her, go check her out. But she will be doing the tutorials on all the clues and it's not a sampler style quilt, I promise. I personally am not a fan of those. I like the fact that you learn different techniques, but I like a little more cohesiveness. So we're not making it scrappy and we're not making it uh, random with all the different blocks. But there's several different skills that you're gonna be needing and you'll be learning those as you go along. So even though some things might be a little more advanced than what you think you're ready for, the tutorials will help you walk through that and you work at your own pace. And I hope to get a Facebook group open. I haven't done that as of this moment, but you should be able to um, also, if you have the quilt, be able to go in there and talk about things and share where you are. And uh, that will be your community for how to um, work on this together. I'm also going to be doing this. Liana has put the sample quilt together and I have seen it. It is gorgeous. So I, it is gorgeous. I will be doing the quilt also. So, um, can't wait to get going. So let me show you what's in the box. First of all, your box might look different than this one. Um, I have a lot of boxes that I have ordered that have my um, special logo and stuff on them. And it kind of just depended on what I had available when I was making your box because I have so many. So like this one right here is one of the styles you might get. You also might get um, <laughs> another box that is actually a leftover. It was not a leftover. I ordered it last year to do the 2023 Advent boxes and I outgrew it. So I still had all these boxes. So it's a light blue box and it says Advent on it, but you'll see the mystery sticker on the outside. It's a little bit bigger box than this, but you'll know it's also your mystery box. I'm just repurposing a box that I couldn't use. So let me show you what is in here. So now the order of things that come out of the box, that's gonna probably be a little bit different, but right on top, you're gonna see this little bag. Okay. You're going to get one of these bags and inside it are all your little miscellaneous items. So first thing, you're going to have a little treat box. Everyone, you have to have a treat. You're going to get a friction pen. You're going to get a little notebook, notebook to take notes on if you need it. You can also just put it in your purse or use it for other projects. Let me see if I can make this a little better. There we go. You're also going to get a set of labels. From Katie Cupcake, there's three labels. This is what they look like. It says love in every stitch. And on the back side, it has your washing instructions. You only need one for this quilt, but you're getting a set of three. You're also gonna get a sticker, and it might be this one, it might be one that's similar. This says, uh, says Vogue Quilter, says Rogue Quilter. And you're getting a large spool of Aurifil thread, white, number 2024 cotton and you're going to get a roll of this seam guide tape the washi tape that you can put on your machine now you do not have to use all these things but if you do uh, need them that's what they're there for so these are just 
notions and fun things to help you with the project, but also just to, to have. There are 10 clues. They're all going to be labeled just like this one. Mystery clue, mystery quilt clue one, two, and so forth. They're all sealed up, so you only get in it when you're trying to get into it. The very first envelope in the pack is going to be this one. It will be sealed up, but I wanted to show you what this is. And then I'm going to show you all the supplies that come in with it. So first thing it does is it tells you uh, we're making a quilt called Who's There? And at the end of the um, series, we'll explain why, what its name is. But the quilt size, we do know finish size is 74 by 86. So it's a good size quilt. And you're making 12 inch finished blocks. It has your fabric, which I'm going to provide you in the box and I'll pull out for you. They're all cut to these measure increments and they are labeled so you know exactly what fabric is what. And then you're going to need a Creative Grids Flying Geese tool. And this is in your kit. And then it's saying as an optional, you might want some square up tools. You may or may not need them. You also might be able to use this to square up. And then with WF just means with the fabric, use a scant quarter inch seam, press seams in the direction that are the arrows that are indicated. So there's your general directions, but also has a place to put your sample fabric. So as soon as you get your fabrics out, cut a little tiny out of the corner, one by one inch square, and put those in each of these as a good reference. And be careful to um, just, just do a little bit because you want to make sure it doesn't interfere with your cutting instructions. But that's the very first thing you're going to do. And then you're going to move your way through all the different clues. But let me show you what else is in the box. You're going to get three project bags because as you go along, you're going to be doing things that build on other skills. So you're going to be cutting things up and putting them to the side. So um, I lied, there's four bags in here. So you're going to be um, getting bags that can be used. You don't have to, but they might be helpful organization. This is my box. And this is the fabric line that I'm doing. It's Sunshine and Sweet Tea. And I'm going to show you all the fabrics that are coming in the kit. Look at that. That's your background, your backing, and all your focal colors, including your binding. So now all everything is labeled. So fabric number five, three quarters of a yard. Fabric number four, they're obviously not here in order. <laughs> We've got our binding. Number six, number four, number two so it tells you how big it is and what the fabric is here's our background fabric and then you get the backing so you'll either get 44 inch width fabric or a 108 uh, backing so if you're getting 108 you'll get two and a half yards or you'll get five and a quarter yards of 44 and in this case this is five and a quarter yards of the 44 so here's my stack of fabrics. So first thing you're going to do is cut a little tiny square. Probably use the selvage. Not a bad idea at all. Um, since you're going to cut that off anyway, right? Um, put the this little square on your sample sheet and it will help you even though these are labeled. They might come off and that's just a really, really good way to keep things straight. So you're getting all of your fabric and let's see. I can do this. There's all my focal fabric. And then here's my background and my backing fabric. Here's my little notions goodie bag. Here are the three um, zipper bag folders. I've got four, three or four. You will get the flying geese template and all 10 clues, including the um, instructions part that we just opened up that that just gives you general instructions and where you're going to put your samples. All that comes in this box. These boxes will be shipping by July 10th 
the um, videos that will be going with them will be made available to those who purchase the box. And then later down the road, um, it's possible that we may make everything open. And But right now it's only available, the help will only be available to those who um, buy the kits and we'll let those people know how to get to their, their tutorials. Okay, let's see what else. Everything fits so nice in this box. I'm thinking this will probably be the box that most of you will be getting. Okay, there we go. There's our mystery quilt, mystery quilt box from Soft Squares for 2024. Please let me know what you think about this. There are eight color fa fabric, hmm. There are eight fabric options that you get to pick from for your focal. There are gonna be lines that you pick from and then I will put them together for you. You'll get them just like this. You can order more than one. I have several people that have done that. And just know that um, this is my first time doing it. And I have a professional pattern writer that wrote this pattern just for us. And that's Carolyn Waite with Forget Me Not Quilt Shop. She does a lot of patterns. She also did a couple of the patterns that were used in my advent boxes from 2023. So she has made this mystery quilt just for us. So you won't be able to buy it or uh, buy it in this condition <laughs> from anybody. So join in. Um, go to softsquares.com under specialty boxes. The link will also be below. This is the mystery box. The mystery box. The mystery box. This is the mystery box for softwares.